Okay.
Tiffany. Nice to see ya. Hey, how's the journey? Getting crowded around here. I can't believe it. We gotta celebrate big time. This party's gonna change everything, buddy. Are you sure you're ready? This is awesome! But it'll be even more awesome once everybody's on the dance floor! <laughs> One who is me. I understand your wish. Oh, great Shelda. You're saying I should chug this snack water upside down, dog! Yes! I was worried at first, but... <laughs> Party treating you, Beth? Hmm, you've seen worse. Yeah, it's really coming together. It's nice to see everybody getting along. <sighs> Listen, Philbo, I appreciate what you're doing, like getting everybody here. It's way less boring now. But these grumps aren't friends. They're just making nice because it's better than being alone. Sure, but who wants to be alone? <laughs> <laughs> you're such a squeeb, but like in a good way. Aww. Thanks. <laughs> I'm gonna hit the dance floor. Hope I see you there. I give this party seven out of ten, which is pretty good, I guess. For Philbo. Me, dance? I don't think this party could handle it. Besides, this isn't really my song. Watch my moves. It's as good as my singing. OMG, they're playing my song! I'm gonna show them what a real party looks like. <laughs> There's a party in my mouth and I'm invited! So the Osteoblast says, looks like the two of us are really boned! <laughs> <laughs> really boned! <laughs> Yeah, Triffy, you're such a treasure. Ah! Ooh, that feels good! Much obliged, stranger. I better talk to Gramble before I lose my nerve. This 
party's a real hoot. Oh, gosh, I don't know. I got two left feet. Wouldn't you rather hear about the captivating history of dance? <laughs> hey, now, I don't want any trouble, Wambus. Gramble, I'm sorry. I've been rude to you, and even worse to your little ones. You... you're serious? No fooling? I don't tell jokes, Gramble. I am not creative. Oh, apology accepted! Of course, no forgiving is complete without a hug! No. But I suppose a dance couldn't hurt. Ah! Ooh, that feels good! I owe you an apology, brother. My earlier insults were unnecessary. Your inventions are quite valuable in capturing research samples, and I appreciate that about you. Your apology is as lacking as your ethical standards, but it's a start. Excellent. Now that we are reconciled, I have a dozen research papers that could use peer review. As you seem to have free time right now, let us begin. And I take it all back. Be at ease. The party lights double as a wave inhibitor. This party is secure. I have something important to ask Chandler, but a certain annoying sibling of mine won't leave me be. You're interrupting personal business. Unless you have something intelligent to say, be gone. Rhythmic gyration has no purpose. I have something important to ask Chandler, but a certain annoying sibling of mine won't leave me be. I bet Floofty will want to learn all about the Desert Empire's dance of certain death. Oh, so you see, the desert dance mirrors the moves for hand-to-hand -hand combat against bug snacks. Thus, the youth were tricked into learning. Fascinating. Hiding purpose and frivolous waste. I will make use of this principle. Oh, you believe it when she says it. Trippany has convinced me of the historic and cultural value of expressive movement. Perhaps I should experiment. Phew, I'm all talked out. Makes me want to shake my tailbone. Yeah oh, you see that? Busting a move. That's enough work. Now it's time to work the dance floor. I didn't think they ain't fun on do day. Yeah! Oh, my chance has arrived. Don't blow it, Fizzlebean. If I knew we were throwing parties like this, I'd have come back weeks ago. Dog, you know I'm DTD, down to dance. But I'm not hitting that dance floor without Snorpy. Ahem. <clears throat> Chandlow, I, I... We've been together for so long, and I've always wondered how you feel about me. Do... Do you want to be my boyfriend? What? Bro, that doesn't make any sense. Oh, I see. Y yes, never mind. F forget what I... Snorpy, we've been dating for years. Wait, wait what? Dude, remember... Wait, wait, yes, I... Sorry, Snorp Dog. Is that clear enough for you? <laughs> I love you, dog. Now let's dance!
we did it, buddy. We're all together again. Well, almost all of us. Hmm. But you know what? Knowing Agabella's out there gives me hope that Lisbeth is out there, too. I mean, none of this would have been possible without you, buddy. I know you have to go back for your job eventually, but... I'd sure miss you if you left. And, well, you still need to interview Lisbeth, right? So... Our end is nigh! What? End? Well, is, is that a metaphor, or...? Are you okay, buddy? All right, I, I know this looks bad, but as long as we keep calm... Our doom approaches! Pray to your gods, children! It's the queen of bug snacks! She's rising from the depths to devour us all! The Grampanati aim to silence us for good. Their machinations are coming to fruition! Now, hold on. We're not gonna die because of some cult or monsters. That's right. We're gonna die because the volcano's going off. That's right. Wait, what? Oh, bad timing. Suppose we're gonna end up buried like all the others, eh? Come on, bro. We can survive this. As long as we got bug snacks, we'll be fine. My barn collapsed. All of my little ones have escaped. Bummer. Whoa, 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 we're homeless and out of bug snacks? Oh, it's a grumpy grump world now. <laughs> uh, dibs on eating Philbo. Please do. I'm quite curious to see the result. Will Befica turn into Philbo or the bug snacks he's eaten? Hold on a moment while I retrieve my notes. Hey, 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 don't give up yet. We may not have homes or snacks, but we have each other. I know it's pretty scary right now, but we can't fall apart every single time something bad happens. We have to stick together. Well said, Philbo. Agabro! Agabro! You're all right! What a pleasant surprise. Welcome back, Dr. Batanugget. Uh, hey, everybody. Chandlow, Floofty, Mr. Troubleham. Doc? I'm glad you made it. Does that mean you figured it out? That's right, Philbo. I know how to get to Liz. That's amazing! We gotta go right away! Sorry to say it, but is now really the best time? This might be the only chance we get. Liz is in danger, and this disaster is only getting started. The worst is yet to come. So spills fall for toxin unending! Quiet, you! Doctor, you are only subjecting yourself to needless risk. Elizabeth is likely deceased. Dog, this bird is alive. And we're not gonna leave her behind. I just need Philbo and, uh, Philbo's buddy. Sorry, Chandler. Bummer. Well, what are the rest of us supposed to do while y'all were gone? You prepare for the worst. What do we need right now? Well, I'm sick of being in the dark, for one. I want to know what's out there. No worries, Beth. I'll build a couple bonfires, maybe a watchtower. Whatever's out there, we'll see it coming. But what do we do when the Queen comes to devour us? Well, I have a few prototype traps that I could put to use. How about the more practical threats? You know, the earthquakes, the volcanoes, and what have you. Simple. We find a way to get off the ground if the need arises. Well, none of that matters if I starve to death. We got my sauce. <laughs> no way, pal. I ain't gonna chow down on that nasty plant goop. Mm. I stand corrected. No more concerns? Great. Let's get to it then. I'm thinking something big is coming, Wamby. And, you know. I know. Agabo, after we get Lizbert, are you two gonna come back to town? Oh, I don't know. I'm starting to like sleeping on freezing cold rocks. But I'm sure Liz misses our bed. Well, it'll be ready for you. I've been keeping your hut clean for whenever you got back. <laughs> You're 
You're such a weird guy, Philbo. Mountain. Still. Tall. Oh, do you need a break? Uh, how about water? Let me check your vitals. No, no, I'm okay. Besides, we're, we're almost there. Right? Right! But in the future, you could stand to do some exercise, or, or just hang out with Chandlo. We're here. Um, how do we get this thing open, Igabel? Turns out she wrote the order backwards. I guess even the great Elizabeth Megafig can still make mistakes. Well, <laughs> Poe Buddy's nerve figged, right? <laughs> okay, I'm ready when you are. We're coming, Liz. One, two, three! Buddy, uh, is Egabo with you? I don't know how we all got separated. Well, you found me pretty quick. I'm sure she's not far. Yuck, what is this stuff? Ugh, it's slimy and cold, and I, uh, I, uh, I kind of want to eat it. Uh, if Lizbert is really down here, we better find her fast. much catching up to do I I wish I could but we're out of time you have to get out of here you have to gather up the others and get off the island o okay then we can talk on the way back no Philbo I can't go with you like this I'm so sorry Are you seriously trying to interview me right now? I regret inviting you. You came here to interview Elizabeth Megafig? Fine. Keep it quick. This? This is the island's true form. It's bug snacks all the way down. That's kind of amazing. It's disgusting. Once you understand what bug snacks really are. 
They're parasites. They get inside you. They make you... You... What you see... They always win. It's not that simple. They're insidious. Patient. You'll show them a weakness, and they'll exploit it. What you see here, this is what's left of everybody who came before us. Of every living thing that wasn't bug snacks. They always win. After I saved Egabel, bug snacks were crawling. That's horrible. I almost lost myself. But somehow I pushed back. I made them into me. After I saved Egabel, I fell into this place. Before I knew what was happening, I was swarmed. Bug snakes were crawling down my throat. They tried to erase me, to make me into them. That's horrible. I almost lost myself. That's right. I'm sorry if I scared you. I just wanted to make everyone leave this awful place. But I can't make bug snakes talk. <sighs> no. The bug snakes are in a frenzy. They have been since we came here. They're so ravenous that they're shaking the ground apart. I'm the only thing keeping this island together right now. But it's like fighting a tsunami with a bucket. There, you have your answers. I hope you write a story worth telling. I'm sorry. I can't hold them back for much longer. Please, go and warn the others. Wait, I, I have one more question. If you're really not coming back, then... Then... What am I supposed to do without you? What do you mean? You've been doing just fine without me. It's only a matter of time before I screw up and ruin everything. I I'm not good at stuff, and everybody hates me. But you... They love you, Lisbert. <laughs> They love the idea of me. I'm sorry I put so much on your shoulders, Philbo. But you, you are the one who... Me? Well, I'm the... What are you... I led you to this terrible island. I filled your bodies with parasites. I ignored all the warning signs. I didn't understand what any of you really needed. So now I'm taking responsibility for my mistakes. I'll keep the bug snacks at bay long enough for everyone to escape. Liz, no, 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 there has to be some other way we can help you. No, I should be the only one to suffer the consequences of my actions. Nobody else needs to get hurt because of me. Uh, where have I heard that before? Acabil, you shouldn't be here. You need to get away. Get up. Get up. Come on. Let's go. Get up. Hey! Uh, ow! Oh, Egabil, stop it! No, you stop it! I didn't sleep in an igloo for months just so you could play martyr! We're getting out of here together. Uh, I... I can't. My control is already slipping. If I step outside this cave, my connection to the bug snacks will break and the island will collapse before I make it another step. Huh. All right. Then I'll get in there with you. Move over. Move over? It's not a car, Bill. See? That wasn't so hard, right? It worked! Egabel, you beautiful genius! <laughs> Wait, how did you lose your eye? Oh, I, I didn't. I just got conjunctivitis. At least the eye patch looks cool, right? Hmm. It does make you look a bit dangerous. So, um, how long before the island explodes? Oh, <clears throat> I don't know. It could be any moment. But I'm sure Liz and I can keep it together, at least until you get everybody out of here. What? So now I'm supposed to leave both of you behind? Hey, don't worry about us. We've been through worse than this, right?
We both survived so much by ourselves. Imagine what we can do when we're together. Okay. Good luck. And I'll see you again someday. It's time to get moving. Get back to Snack's food. We're going to have to take a bit of a shortcut. Hold on. Buddy, head hurt. Oh, bad. Not dream time yet. Gotta save. Who are you? Yes, yes save friends. Who are you? Step, step. name have you two been? I'll explain later. The bug snacks are coming to wipe us out. We gotta get off this island now! I suspected as much. Luckily, the balloon is almost ready to take flight. Great! But where is everybody? They're holding off the swarm as best they can. I've supplied them with all my most dangerous inventions. That'll only buy us time. Snorkdog! You're coming down from the mountain! I need you here! Hold steady, my love. I'm on my way. Oh, but somebody needs to finish fueling the balloon. Don't worry, Snorky. Leave the balloon to me. Go and help Chandler. Splendid. As for you, you may need my snack chop. It's much like the snack trap if it were set to uh, puree. Good luck. My snack chop. Now what? Actually, I don't need this. One has foreseen. The bug snacks will be five feet to the right of where you're aiming. 
I'm a scientist, not an exterminator. You do it if you're so inclined. One is strictly a pacifist. Also, one is pushing seven. Not enough. Ah, but here comes someone with a healthy capacity for violence. Take this device and clear a path for us, please. Enough mortal danger for one day. Let's abscond while the bug snacks have subsided. You don't have to tell me twice. You, however, must continue. The others still need your help. Come on, snacks. Let's see what you got. Uh, Tom, over here. I've just finished another device, the Trip Drone. With this, we can hold off the bug snacks and escape before Chandler collapses. Don't worry, Snork Dog. I can do this all day. Oh, you beautiful fool. I'll pilot the drone. You aim the shot. Fortunately, we're short on connective surfaces. How about this? Hello? Boop. Mm -hmm. That's what you
I knew you'd pull through, bestie. We made it! <laughs> that means Snorpio owes me five bucks. Let's blow this popsicle stand, huh? Guys, I did not hear that.
egg. Easter. Even if we get all the things, we just captured him. Stop dancing. Walk in the corner of down. Who is the little dancing? Hey, Mom, can you get me some more soda? Don't swim in. No, no ready. <sighs> swimming, swimming. I am swimming. Hey, buddy, are you ready to go? No. I know. I can't go. It's gonna take a while for the bug. I can't go back home like this. So I can help you with your story. Great. Let's go. I have to admit, you got guts. Tracking down Elizabeth is not calling for <laughs> It's point is you <laughs> um, Don't worry. She and the fuck this story's a paper. Oh also that wasn't ideal. But if that worst days, huh, buddy? So I hear the elections are coming up and uh I was running for mayor. Hey mom, what happens if you're fired? And you can't work there anymore. She just has him fired. Mom, what happened? Why? How do you get uh, uh, fired? How do you get fired, Mom? Oh. That's it, guys. Guys, I know you want to hear all the things that I got. This is all worth it. This is so many that I got. The grasshopper got that, and that's so freaking hard.
Hello, everyone, and welcome to The Corporate Casket, a bi-weekly series where bad businesses go to die. We will discuss any and everything from bad charities, terrible CEOs, and businesses that have a lot to hide. I'm the Illuminati, and today we're going to be talking about the rise and fall of Papa John's. And honestly, a lot of this is just about the founder and more about Guys, this is Lincoln. Happy birthday! We did not see that. Right, Mom? At the beginning. We only see this. Uh, I think it said happy birthday to you, Chase. I think it said that. No, no, I sent them away. Guess what? It would be hard to make them Can you get the thing that was so nice? The little robot. I got my cake. Hard to say. Has a cake. Has a heart. Okay. Hi guys, I don't know. Hi oh, Billy. Oh my God, guys! I found a strawberry, and that's the end of the video. Bye, guys.